back to my channel. So today's video is going to be on the ColourPop highlighters. And at first I wasn't going to make this video because I felt like I wasn't going to be able to show you the highlighters like truly because sometimes it's hard to see light colors on camera. But I was like, you know what, I'm going to do what it takes for you guys to see these beautiful colors and highlights. So yeah, so without further ado, let's just jump into it. So ColourPop has not yet released when these highlighters will be available, but once I do have some updated information, I'll definitely put a little caption in this video to share with you guys. But as of now, I'm not 100% sure, but I'll keep you posted. So the ColourPop highlighters are the same exact size as their blushes. They are 4.2 grams of product. Their blushes are $8, and I'm going to assume that the highlighters will be $8 as well. I'm not 100% sure, but probably. Um, the eyeshadow looks like this compared to the blush and the highlighter. The eyeshadow is 2.1 grams and it is $5, if you're curious. Um, yeah, so the blush and the highlighters have the same kind of consistency. They have like a wet mousse-like texture, but goes on and wears as a powder. I absolutely love the texture of these. The consistency is so interesting, so different. I love it. So without further ado, let's just jump into these highlighters and get to swatching. So the very first color is called Stole the Show, and this is a really beautiful pearly color, and I will swatch this for you guys. Look how beautiful that is. So the next color is the color Monster, and Monster is a beautiful pearly white as well, except this time it has iridescence of lavender and pink and just, oh, it's so pretty and so unique. I've never seen a highlighter like this. So yeah, let me swatch that. So that right there is a Monster. Next up, we have the color Smoke and Whistles. And again, this is another favorite because it's just a beautiful champagne color that would look good on so many different skin tones. It's kind of like that neutral highlight shade. So that right there is Smoke and Whistles. The next color is the color Hippo. And this is a really cute color too and very unique because it's a really pretty whitish lavender shade and it has like little hints of purple in there, but I swear to you, it is gorgeous on. Don't be fooled by the color. I know it looks purplish, but it is so beautiful, and I'm gonna swatch that right underneath. So that right there is Hippo. The next color we have is the color Spoon, and when I first saw this color, I was literally like, oh my lord. Um, this probably is the most sparkliest of them all, and definitely, really really eye-catching and I oh my god I love this one so if you want to add that extra sparkle to your face spoon is definitely going to do the trick for you so let me swatch spoon so that is spoon right there so the next color we have is called lunch money and this is a golden champagne color and smoke and whistles is more on the pinkier side but nonetheless these are beautiful and this is another favorite of mine So that is Lunch Money right there. The next color we have is called Highly Wasted. And this is a beautiful copper gold with little flecks of pink in there. It's very pretty, very unique. And again, another one that I like to wear often. So that right there is Highly Wasted. So the next color we have is called Wisp. And again, another one of my most favorites. It's kind of more of a darker, dirty gold color. Super, super pretty. A lot of people were asking if this compares to Max Extra Dimension Skin Finish in the color Whisper of Guilt that came out like a gajillion years ago um, for like a holiday or something and it can, it's just, oh, it's beautiful. But this isn't quite the same. Whisper of Guilt is more gold and this is kind of like a darker, dirty gold color. But nonetheless, they're both beautiful and yeah. So I'm going to swatch this. So that right there is the color Wisp. 
So the next color is the color Boba, and this is a really beautiful pink shade with gold sparkles in it. It's so pretty. It's kind of more like a blush tone, kind of, so if you want something that has a little bit more color to it that you can wear as a blush and a highlighter, then Boba is a beautiful, beautiful shade. And we'll swatch that. So that right there is the color Boba. The next shade that we have is called Tasty, and this one is kind of like a orangey coral shade, probably the darkest one I do have. Um, it is really, really pretty. Again, I would probably use this as a blush more than a highlight, but for darker skin tones, this could be a very beautiful highlight. So yeah, I'm going to swatch that. So that right there is the color Tasty. So the next color we have is called Teascake, and this one is kind of like Highly Wasted and Monster Had a Baby, and then this one came out. Um, it's a really pretty kind of goldy pink color with like that pink sparkle in there. Again, a beautiful color. So here's another lighting so I can show you guys the highlighters again. We have Stole the Show, Monster, Smoke and Whistles, Hippo, Spoon, Lunch Money, Highly Wasted, Wisp, Boba, Tasty, and Teascake. So I wanted to show you guys again in natural lighting this time. We have Stole the Show, Monster, Smoke and Whistles, Hippo, Spoon, Lunch Money, Highly Wasted, Wisp, Boba, Tasty, and Teascake. So these were the ColourPop highlighters and I hope that you guys are able to see them in all their beautiful glory. I tried my best to show them in different lighting so that you guys can truly, really, really see them. But again, in real life, they are just so much more beautiful and just the camera does no justice. But yeah, those are all the highlights that I have, and I hope that this video was helpful for you guys. If you guys wanna see any pictures, you guys can always go to my blog, um, messyjessie.com, or my Instagram, Makeup by Jessie. I've posted all of the pictures of the swatches and the names and everything like that, so you guys can check that out if you want. And as usual, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! So this is Henna, one of my doggies, who's feeling extremely lonely right now, so she thought she would interrupt my filming. <laughs> so say hi, Henna. She's shy. <laughs>